Today I'm going to walk you through pretty much everything you need to know on how to get started with the Binance Smart Chain. Listen, the Binance Smart Chain right now is all the rage with good reason. But you probably have heard about this. Maybe you're currently in the crypto ecosystem or maybe you're brand new to it and you're hearing people talk about making mad gains, how much they're earning. Listen, the earnings are real. This is the entire DeFi space on the Binance Smart Chain. You can see how much it's grown. There's over $7 billion in total value locked up. This is the value of the cryptocurrency that's locked up in contracts, ladies and gentlemen. This is extraordinary and it's growing very, very fast. Just a couple of weeks ago, we were under $5 billion, maybe $3 billion. Uh, Heck, two days ago, we were at $5.5 billion. Um, so we're now we're already over $7 billion. This may go to $20 or $30 billion. Currently in the Ethereum ecosystem, there's over $40 billion total value locked in the Ethereum ecosystem. Now, if you're not familiar with e Ethereum, that's okay. I'm going to take you right from the beginning, and I'm going to help you get started so you can start to understand the Binance Smart Chain. And potentially, maybe you can earn you some of those mad gains. But listen, this isn't financial advice. This is more of a tutorial on how to get started. How do you get these Binance tokens? What do you do? Because for some people, it can be a little bit of a mystery. It's not hard. There's nothing hard about it. I promise you i'll walk you through it step by step on how to get started but just understand this nothing in here needs to be construed as investment advice i'm just a youtuber i like to talk about this space i like to educate about this space i love to hypothesize about what can happen with the future of cryptocurrency i believe in cryptocurrency i believe in the future of this technology and i love learning about it i love sharing about it and if you believe in this technology do me a favor smash that like button hit that subscribe button click the bell notification icon and click all all right let's get into this so now in this video, as we walk through how to get started with the Binance Smart Chain, what I'm going to do is I'm going to assume in the beginning that you don't know anything. I'm going to put timestamps down in the description. So please feel free at any point in time to skip ahead to where what the information that you need. First and foremost, if you're just getting started in crypto, before you get started on the Binance Smart Chain, before you do any of this, you need to at least make certain that you already have cryptocurrency. And I have a video that talks about how to purchase cryptocurrency using your bank account. It's one of the easiest, fastest, best ways, most secure ways. Uh, within a couple of hours, I can have money from my bank account inside of a wallet on crypto.com. I'll link that video above where I demonstrate how to do that. That's assuming that you don't have any cryptocurrency. You're like, how do I get started with this? That is a personal video that I send to all of my personal friends who ask me this. Consider yourself a friend of mine, a friend of the channel. Hopefully you're a subscriber as well. And if not, hopefully by the end of this video, you'll see enough value that you will become a subscriber and we'll be on this journey together. Okay, so on the crypto.com app, you would want to buy something like Bitcoin or buy something like Ethereum. If you have that, then you can send it to any exchange. You can send it to an atomic wallet, for example. That may be the easiest way to do it so you don't have to set up a whole nother account. And if you don't have a cryptocurrency wallet, you're going to want one anyway. I'll put a video above so you can set up your atomic wallet. Again, this is assuming that you're just getting started in crypto. Once you have crypto, all this becomes easy. But to get started with the Binance Smart Chain, you first got to get into the cryptocurrency ecosystem. So first things first, purchase cryptocurrency using your bank account. You're not going to be able to purchase BNB tokens on crypto.com, but you can purchase Bitcoin, you can purchase Ethereum. Once you have that, you want to send that over to your Atomic Wallet. Once you send it to your Atomic Wallet and you want to convert it to BNB tokens, Atomic Wallet will convert to BNB tokens. In fact, I'll show you my Atomic Wallet here in action. So once inside the Atomic Wallet, all you have to do if you have Ethereum or whatever, just send it over the way you send Ethereum or there's even Bitcoin down here. I don't have a lot of Bitcoin in here right now, but all you got to do is come over here, click receive. And you're going to send to this address on the crypto.com app. You can just scan this right here and send over the Bitcoin. If you're using Bitcoin, if you're using Ethereum, same thing, come to Ethereum, click receive, and you'll send it to this address or you'll use this code. Now with Ethereum, it's going to, you're going to have a bit higher fees, just so you know, with Ethereum, there's something called gas fees and they're a bit higher on Ethereum. So it's probably better to use something like Bitcoin. Once you have it on your atomic wallet, You'll come to exchange, you'll select your Bitcoin and you'll select BNB tokens. And then you'll be able to put send all and you'll convert your Bitcoin to BNB, click exchange. You'll convert your Bitcoin to BNB tokens. Now, once you have your BNB tokens, it's very simple. There's a simple process you can go through 
to be able to convert those BNB tokens to what's called the BNB Binance Smart Chain token or the BNB BEP20 token. It's the same thing. Binance Chain has what's called a dual chain system. So one chain is the traditional BNB token that you'll see in most exchanges. The Binance BEP token or the Binance Smart Chain token or the BNB BEP20 token, they're all called the same thing. That token is used for on the Binance Smart Chain. Now to understand why this is so incredible, the Binance Smart Chain is very similar, very similar to Ethereum. Ethereum is currently by market cap, the second largest cryptocurrency in the world, and it has some unique features. Binance Smart Chain uses very exact same technology, some subtle differences. And I have a 60 second video. I'm gonna go ahead and play that video now. Now, the Binance Smart Chain is nothing more than a fork of Ethereum. Every single dApp that will run on Ethereum will run on the Binance Smart Chain with slight modifications, including MetaMask. So why is it so fast? Two reasons. Less people are using the Binance Smart Chain. The other reason, if you look at Etherscan, there's 12 million gas limit per block on Ethereum. Binance has larger block sizes. They allow up to 30 million gas. Now, what you need to know about that number is it causes transactions to be faster and cheaper when you combine larger block size and currently less congestion. But even when congestion picks up, they can handle transactions twice as fast for half the gas fees. Now that you've finished watching the video, the, what you need to understand is Binance Smart Chain basically can do pretty much everything Ethereum can. It can just do it a little bit faster, a little bit quicker, and a lot, a lot cheaper. So it's allowed for a lot of different decentralized applications to run. And there's things called yield farming. There's lending platforms. There's so many things that you can do to be able to earn crazy, insane APYs and annual percentage yields. Let me just show you right here on one project. This project here, for example, you're talking about 498%, 60% APY, 103% APY. Now, with that being said, understand something for a moment. I'm not trying to tell you to do any of this. I'll be covering this in future videos. So make certain that you subscribe to the channel and all of this has risk, but there are some real potential returns today. I just want to get you started. I want you to be able to have your own Binance tokens and your own wallet that you're able to interact with on websites, be able to purchase your own tokens. And for now, just at least be able to hold your own tokens, go over to something like pancake swap, which we'll be talking about in a little later video. And you learn how to swap your tokens. If you want to buy more tokens, etc. Once you have MetaMask, once you have BNB tokens, the original BNB tokens, now you're going to download something called the Binance smart chain wallet. And it's going to take you through a process to convert those BNB tokens that you have into the BNB smart chain tokens. It's very simple. Go ahead and watch this video now. Just come up here and you can search Binance smart chain wallet extension. Notice it says Chrome. This is a Chrome based browser. So all these extensions will work. Add to Chrome. Add extension. Binance Smart Chain was added. Here it is. We'll get that pinned so we can see it. Now we'll just need to set it up. It's just a wallet. I own a wallet. I do not own a wallet. I do not own a wallet. Enter a strong password. It can be anything that you want. Confirm the password. Continue. It's going to give you a 12 word phrase. You're going to want to write that down or once you write down your 12 word phrase, the next step is it's going to ask you, it's going to give you three. It's going to ask you for three words. It's going to say, Hey, what was the third word? What was the seventh word? And what was the 10th word? And you've got to type those words in. Once you type those words in, you'll have your wallet set up just like this. Now, why do we need to set up our wallet? You need your Binance chain wallet. I'm going to, I prefer to use my MetaMask wallet, but there's two different types of BNB tokens. The BNB tokens that you typically get, like if you use the Atomic Wallet or if you use normal Binance in the US, the BNB tokens you get are not tokens that are compatible. You can't use those tokens directly on Binance Smart Contract. For example, I have these Binance coins here. If I wanted to send them to MetaMask right now, if I, if I copied in my MetaMask address, you'll see this right here. Please check the address. 
That's not going to work. You have to send the, the easiest way to do this is in the U.S. By the way, if you're not in the U.S. and you were just on Binance, the normal Binance website for everybody else, not Binance.us, if you're on the normal Binance website, this is no problem. I mean, there's cross-chain compatibility. It's not a problem. In this case here, what I have to do is I have to send my Binance tokens from my Atomic wallet. I have to send them to my Binance extension wallet. All right, so once you have these tokens, once you have this Binance Smart Chain wallet set up, you need to make certain that you're on the Binance chain network, the regular Binance. And you know because it starts out with the wallet address is BNB. You click copy, come over to your Binance coin, send your normal Binance coin over. And again, this is much easier if you're just, if you're outside of the US. Click send. Now, by the way, just so you know, We'll click send and we'll put in our password. Okay, that was sent. Now here's the here's something I want to say real quick. If you are in the US, some people use VPNs. My favorite VPN that I use is Tor Guard. I got a 50% discount to Tor Guard. I use this all the time. It is my favorite, my favorite, my favorite VPN. I'll put a link uh, down in the description. I'll put a link tree link over here down at the bottom. I'll put Tor Guard down here. If you want a 50% discount, you'll just need to put in a promo code Crypto Wealth, and I'll have that promo code included down here just so you have that. I'm going to save you some money. I'm going to save you some time if I can. Now, once you have this set up, you're, we're able to convert very easily and send this straight over to MetaMask. We have to connect MetaMask to the Binance Smart Chain. So the way you do that is you come over to MetaMask, go down. I already have it set up, but you can set custom or you can do this. Come right here, go to settings, go down to networks, and click add network. Now, when you click add network, you're going to have to enter in the, for network name. You're going to type, let me show you what you type in actually. I'll just, you can put Binance Smart Ch Chain for network name. For new RPC URL, and I'll put this down in the description, but you're going to have this right here. Chain ID is 56, symbol BNP, BNB, and Block Explorer. You don't have to put anything, but the Block Explorer is BC, BSC, Smart, Binance Smart Chain Coin, BSC Scan.com. Okay, once you enter that in, then you'll just click save and you'll be good to go. And now you can select up here, you'll just come down and select Binance Smart Chain. Now here's what's interesting. Notice this is how it says BNB and B here. I have zero BNB, but I have the same exact wallet address. So now you will send, all you have to do is send your BNB tokens from your Binance Smart Wallet to MetaMask, and it knows to basically convert them over. So watch this. Send. Note, cross-chain transfer to Binance Smart Chain. So it knows that it has to do that already, and it's gonna do that for us. We'll send max, why not? Click send. A little tiny fee, send. Done, just that quick. Now, one reason the smart chain, the Binance smart chain, is so fast is it's important for you to understand. One reason that it's so much faster is simply because the there's not as many people using the Binance smart chain. It's not nearly as congested. Um, in fact, that's not showing up yet. Let's go over to Pancake. See if it will connect. Click MetaMask. Next, connect. Now keep in mind, if you have trouble connecting, you might not be on the Binance Smart Chain. And there's those three tokens right there. Now, let me say congratulations. You are one of the first people on the planet to be able to be on board with the Binance Smart Chain. Cryptocurrency is incredible. Now, if you just started watching this video and you didn't know anything about cryptocurrency, just from this video and the videos that I've referenced and directed you to that are down in the description, 
You have been able to make a cryptocurrency purchase using your bank account. You have been able to set up a wallet such as the Atomic Wallet. You've set up browser extensions such as MetaMask, such as the Binance Smart Chain Wallet. You've been able to send cryptocurrency from one not only have you made a purchase, but you've been able to send cryptocurrency from one app, such as a crypto.com app, to a wallet, such as the Atomic Wallet. You've sent it all the way. You've also sent and received cryptocurrency using the browser extensions. You've converted inside of a wallet from Bitcoin to the BNB coin. Then you sent over to your Binance Smart Chain Wallet. You converted from the BNB coin to the BNB BEP20, the Binance coin, which is used. It's the Binance coin version that is used on the Binance Smart Chain. And now you've got your first BNB tokens. You are able to interact with websites using your MetaMask, which is connected to the Binance Smart Chain. Ladies and gentlemen, you are so far ahead of the crypto curve, it's not even funny. You, this is video has been an entire crash course on getting started with cryptocurrency. Now, the holy grail of the Binance Smart Chain is yield farming. And people want to know, how can I farm tokens? How can I farm things like Cook? How can I farm those auto tokens on auto farm? How do I earn those 137% gains, 537% gains, 224% gains? Is it real? Are people actually doing it? Uh, the truth is sort of, kind of. We're going to get more into that in a future video. So make sure that you subscribe to the channel. I'm going to put together an entire video on yield farming. I'm going to teach you how to do it, teach you how to get started, teach you to understand the, the risk once you get started now let me just say this i believe that it's possible that if you're watching this video today just by buying the bnb coin whenever by dollar cost averaging which just simply means set up a schedule every week or every month just purchase use some disposable income and purchase a little bit more bnb coins or bnb tokens and hold on to those coins the binance smart chain ecosystem is likely to continue to grow Keep in mind, Ethereum has over $40 billion locked up on its platform. And at the moment that I'm doing this video, the Binance Smart Chain, which is a faster, cheaper version of Ethereum, doesn't have even 20% of that yet. In fact, some of the yield farming and the decentralized finance that Ethereum became famous for, some of what you could do on Ethereum is even better. Some of the mechanics, some of the auto compounding that takes place automatically would not be possible on Ethereum, but it is possible on the Binance Smart Chain. I believe there's going to be more money, smart money coming into the Binance ecosystem. So stay tuned for that. So if you just dollar cost average in the Binance, don't even worry about yield farming. Don't even worry about trying to do anything any more complicated and risky. I mean, listen, cryptocurrency is risky. That's the disclaimer. Don't listen to a YouTuber give you advice. That's another disclaimer. Here's the next disclaimer. Going into an ecosystem, which is a subset of Bitcoin and Ethereum, such as the Binance Smart Chain ecosystem, is even more risky than just investing in Bitcoin alone. When you start yield farming, it takes it up to another level of risk. Why are people willing to take the risk? Because they want the gains. But keep in mind, greedy money is usually dead money. So don't be a part of greedy money. But if you want to continue to learn about this ecosystem, because right now decentralized finance is in its infancy. But I believe with everything in me, the decentralized finance will be mainstream in less than five years. Mark your calendar. Mark my words. Thank you for being here. I'll do my best to help you navigate this space as much as I can. I love teaching about it. I love talking about it. I believe this is the future. And I believe decentralized finance gives us freedom. Decentralized cryptocurrency is freedom. This is Crypto Wealth. I'm out. Oh, yeah. And one last thing. If you want to learn how to earn passive income, make sure you're subscribed to my channel and be sure to subscribe to our Crypto Passive Profits newsletter down in the description. All right, I'm out.